pretty. Hey guys, what's up? It's Carissa. Today I'm going to be doing my May favorites. So real quick before I get into the video, I just wanted to say to make sure if you have a video idea for me to put it in the comments below. So just make sure to do that and let's get right into the video. I think I have like more favorites this month than I've like pretty much ever had. I don't do favorites very often because I normally stick with what I know when I don't do much different. I never changed my makeup or anything like that. But this month was full of new things. So yes. The first thing I have I'm just going to start with because it is kind of like miscellaneous and the only thing of its kind. And that is this chai tea and it's by Lipton. Now recently I started drinking tea and I like chai lattes. So I thought I would try a chai tea and see how I liked it and I loved it. It's pretty much the only tea I've ever had and I actually enjoyed. So it's just wonderfulness in a box. Alright, so now I'm going to get into beauty. The first thing that I've been loving in May is my Clarisonic Mia 2 and I haven't stopped using this since I got it but the reason that it's a favorite in May is because for the longest period of time I didn't charge it and I was kind of just using it without the vibration which kind of like defeats the whole purpose of it but you know I was just really lazy and I didn't feel like charging it. So, um, I finally charged it and it's just amazing what a difference the vibration alone makes and it has like really done a great job on my skin. You're so nifty, I could just exfoliate you. Next I have a perfume, this is the Chance Chanel Eau Tendre and you probably are like that's not how you pronounce it and I'm probably just like I don't really care because it's my perfume and I'll pronounce it however I please. This stuff smells like heaven in a bottle. I'm honestly, I'm wearing it right now. It smells so fresh and clean and like flowery and just like fancy. This is like my fancy perfume. And this one's a little bit more like la da if you know what I mean. Next is this Nivea Lip Butter and Raspberry Rose Kiss. And I have had this for probably a year, but I recently just fell in love with it again because I found it. Like, I thought I lost it, but I found it. It was in my makeup drawer, like in the lip drawer where you would expect it to be. But um, for whatever reason, I thought that I lost it. And so I have been using it again, and I just forgot how much I love this stuff because if you look at it, it's like really light pink, but it like gives that effect on your lips, and it looks friggin' awesome. Next, I have the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind um, Concealer, and I really like it because it basically lightens your under eyes without, with like a little bit of like concealing, but it's not a whole ton, which I like because it makes it look a little more natural. And after using this for a while, I noticed that even when my makeup was off, my dark circles were a lot less... They were a lot less, like, in your face. Pretty much everybody on YouTube already uses this, so I'm a little late to jump on the bandwagon, but here I am. I'm on the bandwagon. I'm in the front now, so... This is the Maybelline Master Shape by iStudio Eyebrow Pencil in Deep Brown. I was going to splurge on an Anastasia eye pencil, but then I was like, you know what, I'm going to go to the drugstore and try some out just to see if they work and because I don't want to have to splurge on like a $16 eye pencil when I can get like a $5 one and have the same exact effect. So I bought this one, this was the first one I tried and I loved it. I think my eyebrow game has been on point since I got it and one side is the crayon part or the pencil part and then the other side is the little spoolie to comb out your eyebrows and this has been working phenomenally so thank you Maybelline. The last beauty products I have are these two shampoo and conditioner. Um, this is the L'Oreal Advanced Hair Care Total Repair Extreme Reconstructing Shampoo and the reason that I've been loving this is because my mom actually had it in the shower when I got home from college and I tried it and I loved it. I literally told her it was like Jesus in a bottle. That's how I explained it because words could not describe how awesome this shampoo was. So awesome on my hair. It makes my hair so soft. Like I can't remember the last time my hair was this soft. Why does my nose always run when I make videos? I just don't understand. Alright. <laughs> Alright. So the next favorite I have is this necklace that I got from H&M. It's just a silver necklace with an angle type, um, 
I don't know, a charm. It's not really a charm, but it's an angle. And um, it was pretty cheap. I think it was around 3 or $4. And I've been wearing this a lot this month. You guys have probably actually seen it in a few videos. But I've definitely been wearing this a lot. It just goes with a lot. And it's just simple and easy to throw on. I it's pretty. Moving on to other miscellaneous things. The first thing I have is Just Dance 2. I think they're in Just Dance like 4 or 5 now. I don't even know. Couldn't tell you. I've been playing this on my Wii a lot lately. This is a phenomenal workout. They have a setting called Just Sweat and it just keeps playing songs over and over that you have to dance to and it really is a terrific workout. Like you will be, so I was so sore the next day after like the first day I played this. The first few times I played this I was so sore the next couple of days. Uh -huh. Next I have my Beat headphones and normally I wear my earbuds even though I have these just because they're a little bit easier to carry around obviously. But I have been using these quite a bit lately. If you don't know, um, if, these were actually in my Christmas haul as well as the perfume. And these are the Beat Solo. Um, I think these are the Beat Solo HD. Yep. These are the... These are the Beat Solo HD and they have the um, expandable headband. They have the volume control right here. And these are just really awesome if you like your music to be loud and have good bass and you like to block out other noise. These are noise canceling and these are sick. I love them. Next favorite I have is on my computer. The show that I have been watching lately on my Netflix is Freaks and Geeks. Um, I don't know if any of you have watched this. I don't think it's super popular. The show is about teenagers in high school. But some of the main characters are the best actors out there right now. The other main characters are James Franco, um, Seth Rogen, and um, and Jason Segel. They all star in the show, and the show takes place in the 1980s. <laughs> I've been basically obsessed with this show and I've been watching it every day. I like it because it is probably one of the only shows I've ever seen that's very true to how high school really is. I like what I like. If you don't like it, then you don't like it. That's just that. So that is my May favorite. Please like it down below, leave comments with video ideas or response to this video. I read all your comments and I try to respond to them. And yeah, if you're not subscribed, hit subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!